Hey guys, I'm Monica and welcome to my channel Food Box Monica. So happy Holi everyone and today's recipe is dedicated to the festival of colors and today I'm going to share my mom's Malpua recipe with you all which is so easy to prepare and taste delicious. So if you like this recipe don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon so that whenever I post a new video you can get notified. So without further ado let's start cooking. So to prepare our malpoas, I am taking here 250 grams of sugar and to that I'll add milk. So here I am taking 250 or 300 ml of milk and we have to dissolve the sugar completely. And now here I am taking some dry fruits, you can use dry fruits of your own preference and I'm adding the chopped dry fruits into the sugar and milk mixture and now I'm adding one tablespoon of soft or fennel seeds to it. This will really give nice flavor to your malpuas. You can also uh, add peppercorns crushed peppercorns if you want just a little bit and now I'm adding all-purpose flour to it to make a pancake consistency batter so I'll add flour little by little till I get my perfect consistency so now we have to mix it nicely till all the till it is nicely mixed and there are no lumps I have added little bit of more flour and now I am using a whisk to mix this nicely so there should be no lumps and now I am adding 2 to 3 tablespoons of condensed milk this will really give nice creamy flavor to the malpuas You can also use koa to make your malpuas, but the process, the recipe will be completely different. I'm using condensed milk here. And now I'm just nicely mixing everything. And I've added a little bit of more flour because I felt the batter consistency was a bit watery. And now I'm nicely mixing the batter. And now I'm adding two tablespoons of suji or semolina to the batter. And after you add any ingredient, you have to nicely mix. And now I'm adding one pinch of baking powder just before I'm ready to deep fry these uh, malpuas. And now after I've added baking powder, I've mixed the batter again. And now time to deep fry the malpuas. So for deep frying, I'm using clarified butter or ghee. You can also use oil if you want, but ghee really gives nice flavor. And that is why I'm using ghee for this. And ghee is also healthier than refined oil. So. And now heat should be on low and now I'm pouring the batter little by little with the help of a spoon and make sure there is distance between the malpuas because after you pour the batter it will expand a bit so it's better to keep little distance between the malpuas and now as you can see they have expanded and now we have to cook them till they are nice and golden on low flame. Make sure that flame is not high. Flame should be on low and look at this beauty guys. This is looking perfect. And I'll make the other malpuas as well. And if you have not tried malpuas yet, 
do try this recipe you will love it if you have tried malpuas try this recipe because i am not preparing any sugar syrup separately to prepare malpuas this is very easy and convenient and it is tasty as well so do try this recipe and share your feedback in the comment section also i'll mention the detailed recipe including the ingredients in the description box so do check description box for the detailed recipes and now these will be also be ready in 10 to 15 minutes so each batch will need 10 to 15 minutes of slow frying and serve this with condensed milk or rabdi if you have enjoy the festival with your family and friends happy holi to you all again we'll meet in our next video i post videos every friday so stay tuned thanks for watching guys bye take care and happy holi again bye